Hello and welcome to my channel. So today I want to talk to you about not only goat bike but also about uh, your comments. I made a video a few months ago before the new model came out, the V3 models or new Power Goat or Billy Goat V2. I made a video with kind of title that goat bikes, bicycles will be better or faster than wide freedom bicycle and uh, i got a lot of negative feedback and i want to make everything clear up so first of all i'm not here to trash the wire freedom or wire cruiser bicycles because they're a total different category but the fact i claimed before just got a solid proof that good bicycle are faster that's something i'm happy uh that my words was not just empty uh empty kind of uh, projection because that time i didn't have the bicycle but i did give you my kind of uh, projection based on the spec and also based on my experience with uh prior models so the prior models was like 1000 watt with this one is 2000 watt power it's totally different what is uh previous models are and i'll explain you why i'm gonna see that because it's a little bit rainy outside but not as much but i can tell you that uh the difference between uh why freedom and this bike it's a lot uh when i think the gold bicycles are better i'm saying they're better in every single way for some people who is looking for this type of bicycles i'm not saying this bicycle will fit everybody because i always tell that you need to pick the one will fit you the best based on your needs but i will clear the some things up because some people are making assumption and also some people are just waiting for something not right for them so if you're waiting for road bicycles be faster they are faster than wired bicycles how much faster it's a good question who gonna ride them because i think it's about uh, about up to five miles faster they are okay that's what i saw the numbers based on some other uh videos posted so i never tested white bike i did reach them actually uh i sent an email asking if they can send me a loaner so i do it completely free as i never did before with the loaner bicycles because usually company never send send me any loaners uh i never actually did this way without owning the bicycle to test it out and see my experience so if you have any questions i can do like follow-up videos like this so I told them, okay, I'll do just one time testing. I'll give you back the bicycle free of charge, but they refused. So I'm not sure if it's because they are afraid for me to show the actual speed or actual performance. But before going to these details, I don't really care because I'm not going to really go over how bad or why you shouldn't buy Y Freedom of wire cruiser but i'll tell you why the gold bicycle is better and then i'll tell you why you shouldn't buy gold bicycle and besides the wire freedom there's more any other companies for example right now there's another company on the market which is ethel which been in business for a while already and they have actually already very well bicycle perform which is um, out of perform the wired bicycle with dual motors with amazing performance the price of course a little bit higher supposed to be so they did came out with a five star they i talked to them as well they gave me actually a special discount for you for my viewers a uh, hundred dollars off and after i compare them with a wired bicycle they are actually not only cheaper because i didn't know that wired charge you extra fee for shipping but the bicycle actually might have to perform the wired i cannot really tell about performance because i don't have none of them but i can tell you that 
ESL 5 star will be cheaper, at least $100 cheaper, because they do free shipping. And I have a discount code, which will be eRights. I'm going to post link in description and the code. So if you're interested in wire freedom, so you might want to consider to check them out. But they're very similar, but of course the price will be amazing because they not only they have many colors, but they give you options to attach the front basket and the motor looks like it will be a little bit more powerful and you get USA support as well. And I think the owner very dedicated to the bicycle as well. So that's kind of really stand out for me. And I think I will also have opportunity to test them out once they're going to be available on the market. So if you subscribe to my channel, you will see the video most likely probably in a few months. I'm not sure when they're going to be available, but somewhere in probably March or April. But if you follow my channel, you'll see the notice. So first, this bicycle comes totally differently. Not only the, I will talk about the motorbike. Motorbike comes with a larger motor, which is direct drive, which is more reliable and longer lasting motor usually. The only negative uh, as uh, usually is would be the torque. But after I test it uphill, this bicycle auto perform many other bicycles which would claim to be 100 new meter torque bicycles and this one only claiming as 110 so my own experience all these numbers on paper is kind of useless until you really sit on the bicycle and ride it so um, after testing this bicycle i can tell you it's going twice as fast uphill without any issue without any delay in the motor no any issue after riding uphill so let's say i rode a bicycle uphill the one i tested on in my full video so this bicycle came up to the hill like 15 miles an hour versus to bafang motor i tested before 1000 watt motor it was 100 i think 100 new meter torques yeah 100 new meter torques and that bicycle was about eight miles an hour there was no problem after but some of them would get controller issue and so on after the test. So that's the biggest difference. I'm not saying that uh, Bafang motors are bad, but I'm saying that this motor actually might be even much more torque power. And for a few reasons, because this bicycle comes with 20 inch tires and they are more like city tires. So if you're planning to ride off-road for hunting, this bicycle might be really great, but you might consider to change the tires to off-road tires. It's not expensive. It's pretty uh, actually budget. Like I think it's about 150 to 200 dollars to swipe the different tires. But again, it's all up to you. Versus to Wire Freedom or E cells, those tires are larger and probably will be better handling off-road as riding in a woods or anywhere you're planning to ride because they already usually come with off-road you're gonna get much more torque most likely on this bicycle versus than wire freedom in going uphill because the smaller diameter of the wheel would have more torque since it's much closer to the motor but again uh, you have to test it out to see it and i never tested the wire freedom but i will try to test it easel and give you my experience as well in the time when I will receive the bike and control like it under the seat. I did uh, have a not I noticed that the controller was loose under the seat, and I attach it with a double tape. It takes me only like 15 minutes to remove few bolts and reattach it. So it's very simple procedure was, but you don't have to worry about this because. The, all the new batches gonna receive right now, they're gonna be already attached because I, I told them and they're already taking care of it. So it's already, this issue was taken care. Of. So any new batch already will have a controller attached so there will be no different like, wobbling sounds. Um, then this bicycle come with a nice, uh, it's 550 pounds uh, rear shock, which, um, Probably maybe some firm for lighter riders, but I weight over 200 pounds. It's actually perfect for me. 
uh, the battery is a 25 amp, which is larger than Wire Freedom and E-Cells. Uh, that's something you may also consider if you're looking, but I'll tell you at the end of the video as well, the main reason to consider a gold bike versus Wire bike cycles or any uh, like mountain fat tire bicycle because they are different. So you can not only extend the battery so you'll have like 45 amp battery just right over here in cover it also as you can see i attach the back inside you can buy extra rack if you want to from the gold bicycles it comes with a uh, two mirrors which is uh, actually glass and metal actually i broke one when i dropped the bicycle but it's still okay but have some crack it does come with a um, two safety feature so it will not be getting stolen one key right over here so it's, you have to use a key in order to start the bicycle and also over here is a lock which will lock the tire so you can leave it outside so people cannot really uh, steal the bicycle unless they carry it but you can also install some alert somewhere in a battery or under the seat so it will alert you in case somebody start to move your bicycle that's very important stuff to have then this bicycle comes with a really nice headlight which has a dual bin so it has a low bin and a high bin also it comes with a turn signals which are already ready to ride on the streets more not only legally but i'm saying a safety so you get dual on the front and also on the rear so you have turn signals to the right and left uh my my bicycle does not have blinkers on the back but the new models will have blinkers on the back it does come with a braking light tail light uh, nice front fork suspension which is adjustable and lockable so tires it's a uh, 20 by four and a half inches as you can see it's three tires it's a little bit thicker and i know like i also mentioned before that the tire touching the fork a little bit there was not much friction but looks like it was touching with the hair but again it was very close call so because i put 25 psi on the front i believe so as soon as i reduced to 15 everything become normal but if you look close to the tires there's a um, uh, recommendation to have it between 10, uh, 3 to 15. I usually recommend to keep it around 10 on the front, 15 to 20 on the back. So if you keep it 15 on the front, that will actually make it perfect. So you'll have no friction. But this issue will be fixed as well on the next batch. So if you order right now, most likely the bike will come with already fixed all this issue. Also, the good bikes uh, have new updates that they're gonna move from the cells they use right now uh it's not a large company but they're gonna move to samsung cells i heard the cells they use right now have no issue no problems at all it's um, also good cells but they're gonna move to more branded cells and uh, about the branded i saw like videos on youtube uh, somebody who promote wire freedom bicycles because of course she wants to make commission but she never wrote actually and she never saw one she go by wherever she saw online and i don't blame her i usually don't do those type of videos but i can tell that uh, all these parts on this bicycle high quality and usually uh, some branded parts are not going to be as good usually sometimes like so the braking on this bike is a four piston hydraulic zero issue with this one and i do have the same brand on my older version only two piston which also have no issue this bike comes with a mag wheel uh most people doesn't know but mag wheels always more expensive versus just regular with a spoke and also they are a little bit heavier so usually they are not good to use on uh, larger wheels because they will be too heavy but for this type of size of the bicycle also uh it will be much faster bicycle and for faster bicycle you want to have a stronger wheels so they use mag wheels which more gave you safety riding on the higher speed if you're planning to do that 
and this bicycle perform over 40 miles an hour very easy on the short road i reach about 38 miles an hour pretty simple but i think uh in my ex like numbers i calculate i think why freedom would do about 35 miles on the same spot so about three miles less most likely that's what i think and i want just to give you a little bit tour about the bicycle so you probably didn't see it's a bit uh, not really raining but more like high community right now this bicycle is very unique to many other bicycles, not only for the power, but also the way the design, the frame. I think uh, it's much better than uh, Wire Freedom for higher speed because you can see on the joint also the frame, the way it's built. And I don't have pedals right now, but I'm going to have pedals pretty soon. They should be in the mail, so I'm going to put them on. Not just because I'm going to use them, uh, but I need them for few reasons. Because I'm going to plan to do range test, and I don't want to walk with the bike once I run out of the battery charge. And also, as people saying, without pedals, it's not really a bicycle. So for all the people who think it's not a bicycle because there's no pedals, once I put the pedals, it will be a bicycle for you. And I went over some comments in under the video I posted before. So many people were saying, so buying the gold bicycle will get you in trouble with the cops because it looks like more motorcycle. I can tell you that if you're planning to ride the wire freedom uh, on higher speed, doesn't matter which bike you're gonna ride. If the cops see you you're speeding over the limit, they're gonna stop you. And also I heard that they do have right now in some areas, in some city, in some state already under radar, basically they got notified already that those bicycles are faster. So you may want to cover the label because they already know the wire freedom are going fast. Uh, they think 40 miles an hour, which actually not really... Uh, True, I think they don't. I don't think I will ever reach 40 miles on that bicycle, but I never test it, so you know probably better if you own one. But again, if you're planning to buy a bicycle just based on what the cops gonna do to you, then I recommend not to buy any of them. Just buy some slow bicycle like class two or class three probably, and ride with a speed limit. And that's why I'm saying that buying wire freedom or buying gold bikes because might be not right for you so you need to make your mind what actually you want if you're thinking you're gonna buy wire freedom and you're gonna ride 35 or 40 miles an hour in the area where the cops know that people spinning on the bicycles regardless what bicycle you're gonna ride you're gonna get in trouble and mostly if you're riding crazy when you're riding off-road i don't think you're gonna ride over 30 miles an hour regardless of what bicycle you're gonna buy usually people ride about 10 to 50 miles on the flat and downhill they usually about 25 miles i know some people might go faster but it's completely unsafe and also you may kill somebody on the way downhill if there's many people like hikers and so on so when i go personally riding on the trails i usually go about 15 to 20 miles an hour which actually good for me and you don't really need wire freedom uh, because you can do the same thing on the gold bike if you are not planning to pedal it so let me just give you an idea why you should buy gold bike versus the wire freedom or wire freedom versus gold bike so let's say if you're planning to buy a bicycle because you want to pedal like exercise to have your feet straight out as a comfortable and you want to go off-road riding if you want to sit on the seat saddle not as comfortable as a goat bicycle because it's larger you can ride with two people if you want to actually i did ride with my wife so it was just fine so you may want to go with wire freedom but again you might want to check e-cells because e-cell have the same bicycle similar but actually better and by better, I'm saying based on my spec, whatever I saw online. I'm not saying better because I test them, because I never test none of them. But as of today, 
by checking all they offer. They're very similar, but you save a couple hundred dollars on ESL. And you have actually options to choose different frame size. I think there's two frame sizes, 17 and 19, with ESL 5 star. So if you're planning to do off-road riding, go hunting, and you really want to have like a um, bicycle which you can pedal it and get uh, good exercise, not to use throttle much, then uh, wire freedom might be great. If you're planning to ride the bicycle fast and not really pedaling, then you don't want the wire freedom, you don't want itself for reason because you will want to have type of motorcycle, like e-moped style. You want to see it comfortably on the bicycle, like on the sofa, like this. And you're going to be straight up position. First of all, you have mirrors, very comfortable. You got full, uh, like, kind of safety, like with a signal, turn signals, lights, everything with a horn. Basically, full setup as motorcycle. Again, this bicycle will outperform wide bicycle with the speed and i think with the climbing as well so if you want like never pedal it it you will be better on this bicycle also because you got larger battery and you can attach easily the second battery which they sell already on the website or you can buy aftermarket i don't recommend to buy aftermarket for two reasons first uh you never know how good quality depending where you're gonna buy it so second, you might be uh, void your warranty if you use aftermarket second battery. You may want to check with the good bicycles to see if they void your warranty, if they find out you use a second battery because they might actually damage controller and then you will be out of warranty. They do come with one year warranty. The customer service is great with good bicycles. I'm not sure what is why freedom. I did have good experience with reading a lot of uh, good uh, and positive feedback about ESL uh, that uh, the people can call them up on the phone and get hold of uh, the representative very quickly so that's something really positive for me I never call neither of the companies so not only you buying nice beautiful bicycle like if you choose a gold bicycle they do have three different options they do have like options where you have a like billy goat with a kind of not really step through somewhere in a low frame design which somebody would like and they do have now which will come in next batch power goat which will have a longer seat with the options attaching to battery so you'll get 40 amp battery you can install one inside so you'll get a total of 60 volt with a it will be like a 40 amp battery, so it's about 200, 2400 watt hours. About as double what's wire freedom or e cell so far. So that's why if you're planning just to ride on the throttle mostly or just casually pedaling, then you won't go with bicycle. If you want to pedal it, you want wire freedom, okay? You can still pedal it most likely pretty simple but i would not recommend to buy gold bicycle to go off-road and just uh, as exercise like you would do because when you do really want to exercise you don't really need as powerful bicycle as wide bicycle to be honestly uh, i think 750 watt motors would be more than enough that's what i had my experience with running with 750 motor and 1000 watt motor in a hill area when you pedaling because when you start to pedal even with 750 motor i almost went to any hill in my area very simple and again if you have any questions i will be glad to answer you and um, because i decided to make some special i'll show you what i will offer for free to at least five buyers of the gold bicycle it will be directly from my channel the gold bicycle are not sponsoring this offer and it will be sent directly from me let me show you close up so if you're buying bicycle with uh, my affiliate link and with a uh, code that um, you're gonna get from me once you buy it once you receive your bicycle you email me 
or send me a message on Facebook. I'll link, I'll post all the links in description about the phone holders. So you're gonna get these phone holders, okay? Your room. I review them in the past, and I use them most of the time. As you can see, it's a metal. It's very good for larger phones and very reliable. Actually, it's good for motorcycle or this type of bicycles. Again, with the time, I might have even better promotion, but uh, it's uh, going to be, I have five pieces right now, and I think only four left. So if you buy gold bicycle with 10% off, the code is that. Link in description. Send me a message on Facebook or Instagram. And uh, I would need your order number confirmation and some other confirmation. And once I confirm, I'll ship you the free phone holder. And if somebody contacts you and asking for shipping price, uh, like shipping cost, they probably a scam. I will ship it for free in USA only. So you will pay nothing for the phone holder. And thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.